My name is Elizabeth Lewis, and I go by Betsy. Andrea Levy-Smith, I go by Andy. Or if you want to be pompous about it, Andrea Levy-Smith. Ooh, yeah. I am professor of Spanish and chair of the Department of Modern Languages and Literatures. I am associate professor and chair of the Department of Historic Preservation. So my digital project started out as a, a project that I did with undergraduate students, and we created a digital exhibition on women and charity in Spain, starting in the 18th century and going through the 20th. We collected a lot of different digital items, but the thing that we talked about during the colloquium was about a database that I created with my students, about two journals that women were made by women or for women. And my project is an ongoing project, actually. It's data collection surveying of cultural resources in Fredericksburg, and that means basically houses and buildings in Fredericksburg. And traditionally in preservation, you do this with a clipboard, paper, pencil, but that's not very efficient or effective. So instead, we've been using this WordPress platform so that students can go out uh, with their phones and actually input the data directly into their phones, including things like pictures of the site. And then that allows for much easier analysis afterwards and a lot less error, especially in data transfer. I think it was a way for me to get students involved in my research in a meaningful way. Um, I mean, some of it they were just inputting data, but they were also at the same time, they were analyzing that data. They were, for in my case, they were looking at like a 19th century journal and we were actually in Madrid when we collected this data. So they were skimming all of the articles and we were talking about them as we went through the entire collection. It was a way to get them engaged in the research that I was doing. Again, I can't speak for other fields, but in mine at least, data collection is a very important part of what we do. Uh, data analysis is a very important part of what we do. And I think that's true of lots of fields from the humanities all the way to the sciences. In, in terms of the, the database system that we chose by using WordPress and plugins in WordPress, uh, students are able to focus on the quality of the data themselves instead of focusing on the minutia of the software. And that was really important to me because the data is already complicated enough without adding the complication of using Excel for text and then you know, some kind of picture system for photos and then trying to mix it all up together. This way it keeps it all very orderly, very easy to access and online, which is even better because it's platform independent. So it, it just makes everybody's life so much easier.